uh, in my introductory uh, class the first day, I have mentioned you that if you are very good in credit management, if you really know credit management functions and you can claim confidently that, yes, you are good in credit management, then you have wider opportunities uh, in Bangladesh and all over the world uh, because uh, you have position in the banks, insurance companies, leasing companies, uh, uh, all types of financial institutions, non-bank financial institutions, some NGOs, they're related with credit management, and also many companies that do business on credit, so they need proper credit management. So if you really study hard and if you really want to know credit management, then this is the right course, and this course will help you to prepare yourself with credit management and to get a good job in the future. So what is credit? Yes, you can define credit in so many ways. You know what is credit, but uh, we want to define as a part of the course. And that's why uh, we need to define textually or from the experiences. So what is credit? Credit is a contractual agreement, contractual agreement where well, there are two parties. One is borrower and another one is lender. And that's why credit is a contractual agreement in which a borrower receives something of value now and agrees to repay the lender at some later date with consideration. So uh, there is a contract between lender and borrower. So borrower is getting the money or some other uh, assets uh, in value, and later borrower has to repay uh, that amount with some consideration, what is basically known as interest or profit. But this credit has so many other meaning, you know, that sometimes uh, we use credit to give credit someone. We say, oh, it's your credit. Uh, in accounting, uh, we are using debit and credit to record transactions. Credit, these words sometimes used to explain, express credit worthiness of a person. Credit worthiness. Ekjoner shakkomota prakash korar jonno a credit shabdo amra babohar kore naki. A jamon amra boli, he has a great credit, he has great credit. So he is not worried about the bank rejecting his mortgage application. So we use this kind of word as well. Sometimes we use credit to a deduction in the amount one owes. Imagine someone owes his credit card company dollar one thousand, but he returns a purchase or dollar three hundred to the store. So these way there are various uses of the word credit, but for these codes, which one we are accepting? We are accepting the two. One is credit is a contractual agreement in which a borrower receives something of value now and agrees to repay the lender at some later date with consideration, generally with interest or profit. And another one that is credit also refers to the credit worthiness or credit history of an individual or company. So these way we are taking these two sentences as credit. Uh, for a uh, credit management student, this is very much essential to understand credit history. So if you have bank account, it's all right, very good. If you don't have bank account, open your bank account before joining your next class. Agami class said join for a racket or the bank account fellow because you have to develop your credit history. If you have a bank account, if you keep your pocket money to the bank, and whenever you need, you withdraw the money. So if you have good transactions uh, with your bank account, your credit history will go up. And later when you will go for borrowing money from the bank, bank will obviously uh, be positive to provide finance. 
So what is credit history? Credit history is important all the time when people, companies, they are looking for bank loan, bank facilities, bank finance, and banks are really evaluating credit history. So as a credit management student, you need to understand what are the components of credit history? Uh, what components we consider under credit history? It includes number of account, credit accounts. That is uh, uh, how many credit accounts you have, the types of credit accounts. Uh, it's what kind of uh, credit accounts. It is a short-term credit account, it's a mid-term, it's a long-term, uh, what kind of it is. Uh, uh, it's a, uh, uh, an annuity basis. That is you have to repay the money uh, on installment or... Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So what I mentioned that uh, credit history is important. I'm talking about credit history. I I I I. Uh, I'm uh, uh, requesting you guys to open bank account because credit history is important. At the same time, uh, we're checking the components of credit history. Uh, my connection was disconnected, so I don't know exactly how many points you have listened. So I'm repeating a little bit. Uh, it's the first one, number of credit accounts. How many credit accounts you have? Types of credit accounts. What, what, what types uh, uh, of your credit accounts? It is a short term, mid term, long term what kind of payment system it is it is monthly installment quarterly installment it is semi annual or annual or you are paying after 5 years a lump sum with consideration uh, uh, with with interest or with profit the second one how long each account has been open so at the accounter may not important the other account on a purono the put in projection would say a good reputation their credit history also good so whenever you need money, you can get money from the bank. Your credit history, hello, she China bank ticket, provision or to pay the bank. Then amounts owed. Ki puriman rin brahon pure cho rin er puriman kotho rin jodi niye thaka hai. Na nile er company information thakte na amount of available credit use. Jodi kake at the rin sanction kora hai, kato koi kothi thaka sanction kora hua se. So that's why we need information amount of available credit use. Kipuriman use kora wese, abong kipuriman use kora hani. Whether bills are paid on time, jeshokol bank related, financial institution related, transaction related, bill wese shekuru tikko to purushut kora wese kena na hani. Number of recent credit inquiries. That is also important. If you have a a credit account. So uh, recently, uh, credit inquiries chulo kina. No, to puro credit e chono. Dakha hoye chhe kina. Jana chesta kora hoye chhe kina. All this information are recorded in the bank. So these way banks evaluate one's uh, credit history. Uh, besides these, bank also consider uh, whether the consumer has a history of bankruptcies. Uh, uh, bankruptcy, they will be aware of the loan client, uh, whether they have a special rights that is called liens, uh, judgment or collections. Uh, so uh, some relevant information also considered and these way a uh, bank evaluates credit history of their consumer, their customer. So credit history is really important. What are the advantages and disadvantages of uh, credit? Uh, obviously, there are some advantages and disadvantages of credit. 